Oh, baby. First shot is of the bridge. The very bridge where Law is confronting Doflamingo. I'm here for it. Guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Jack the Bus, and we are back in Dressrosa today. It is proven to be insanely chaotic, to say the least. And now half of the straw hats are just gone. Headed to Zhao with Caesar. But we ended with Law basically taking Jola to the bridge to, uh, I guess, bait in Doflamingo. I don't know if he wants to, like, have a conversation with him or actually fight to kill. But I just want to know more about them, man. Like, their pasts. Meanwhile, in the Coliseum, Rebecca and, and Cavendish are kind of the focuses of Block D. I'm pretty sure it's going to be one of those two that make it out. Make sure you leave a like on this one. It does help me out quite a bit. And let's hop into it. Guys, guys, let me know what happened 13 years ago. What, what kind of family are you? <laughs> oh, just ones that would give their lives? Oh. Oh. What? He gave her up. Oh, dang. <laughs> he got it right, though. I feel like her, like, her, or like, her ability would kind of just annoy him. I don't know. Like, he's just taking things seriously right now. <gasps> the wind. When the anime wind blows, it's getting serious. Yeah, Doflamingo had to choose between the Smile Factory and Caesar, but I feel like Caesar is a Smile Factory, basically. What is the grudge about, guys? Tell me! It's not a grudge? Ah! To attain that man's long cherished ambition. Oh! He's going to. Oh, shoot, the animation's popping! Oh, the. We'll rip all those fish! Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. He's running at him. Dude, in room, he can just teleport, man. Dude, this goes so hard. He's fighting emotionally. He's trying to just draw it through him. Is that hockey? The blocked it? Guys, come on. No. Okay, we're well, well, back with the straw hats. Some of them. <laughs> Chopper. Dude, they're, they're probably just elated to not have to be in Dress Rosa fighting right now. Caesar is just an honorary straw hat at this point, man. Spent so much time on the ship. He's sitting on him. He's Zoro, but Zoro's bad directions. Hey, he did find the Colosseum, though. Oh, but Sanchi had to leave his love, Violet. But it seems like he holds, yeah, too much of a grudge. Uh, he's not focused on getting away. He really wants to take down Doflamingo himself. But apparently there's more to it. Thought back and I can't stop shooting. Oh, wait, yeah, he saw Doflamingo and like he saw him like in those visions. When did, when did Momo see this? <laughs> he was just lurking. Every human has a cool side. They get excited when they see blood. That was kind of like established when the Coliseum stuff started. Damn. Damn. That's why... Wait, why did he see him, though, whenever he turned into a dragon for the first time? Well, not the first time, but when we met him. Oh, Kanjiro! Oh. This is when they were set to escape, and then it all went wrong. Oh, we got to hear Kanjiro's voice. Oh, yeah, Momo saw firsthand who, who captured Kanjiro. He's thinking about Violet. <laughs> He's so far from his love. Government will protect me. Ooh. Oh, shoot. She's leaving? Dude, I feel like she's like actually a long term love interest for him. It's cool. Our boy found the one. Oh, no. And that's when they split off. And that's when he left. We gotta see her again one day, right, man? Dude, they're in love, man. Oda, don't stop true love. Don't you do it. Everybody, even the giraffe hates Rebecca. Did you see that face? Oh. Damn, she's going out with a bang. Hell yeah. Violet. Ew. <laughs> oh, wait, what? To the palace. She did she lie to she lied to Sanji. She stayed. <gasps> oh shoot. I feel like that that she definitely knows she's gonna do something dangerous, and that's why she told him that so he wouldn't worry or he wouldn't stop her. Oh no. Violet. Oh. Vice Captain! What are you talking about? <laughs> 
Oh my gosh, he's having a full-fledged conversation with them. This is big steps, Bart. <laughs> Dude, I, I would say I want him to join the Straw Hats, but he's almost too much of a fanboy. Otto? <laughs> what an honor. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. I'll be counting on you. Oh my gosh. Zoro's counting on me. Zoro senpai. <laughs> you can't not love Bart, man. Go get him, buddy. Look at him run. Na, 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 na. <laughs> the soundtrack, man. Oh, it's so good. <laughs> He's like role playing being a straw hat. He's, why is he running like that? Back to Bakhti. That whip is crazy, bro. Like that, that, that just one shots you. If I see this exact shot one more time, I'm gonna freak out. Rolling Logan will be final four for sure. Does he actually roll though is the question. I've only seen him run. Oh, he is. Does he just actually just tumble? Oh my gosh! It's freaking like Choji from Naruto, man! It's a human boulder! Oh! Oh my gosh! Okay, so I definitely foresee like Rebecca getting him to like, like basically roll off the arena, honestly. I can picture it. These guys just do not see the strategy. It's so obvious. To oh. She used to, her blade against his. Still isn't cutting anyone. <laughs> Dude, the audience, man. You guys already heard what, what Cavendish said. Oh, no. It's actually dejecting her? I thought she didn't give a damn about what people said. It's kind of hard not to whenever the whole Coliseum is booing you, but... Oh, she's thinking back to the soldier. Bring out all your power. Rebecca! Damn. Dude, his voice is still so good, man. I think it's because it's like in conjunction or in contrast with like who he is. It's like a little toy soldier and how he raised her. This is for you, baby. Every time she starts freaking out, she just locks in and remembers the soldier. Oh, wait. No, she still isn't cutting. Still isn't using her blade against him. She'll kick him though. Man, they all like you're so biased, man. Back to the water dance. Rebecca! <laughs> Just every time I hear him yell that, it's so funny. I, I pretty much, yeah, pretty much figured out what she's doing, Mr. Announcer. Pretty much got it. I'm shocked the other fighters aren't. Like, she stands near the edge for a very clear reason. And if they get eliminated by that, they honestly deserve it. No, has never hurt anybody in any battle. Dang. I mean, that's... Oh, is she using observation hockey? I think she's just skilled, bro. I'm not going to lie. Where's Bart? He's going to come running in. <laughs> he can't even lie. I like Cavendish, like, smiling at her. I have to find reasons to like Cavendish. Oh, my gosh, man. Uh-oh. Wait, Logan has his sights set on her. My gosh. I think she can get him to roll. No, I guess he, he only rolled once he caught her, caught the other guy, no? Illweed Chan. That's a, that's, that's a name. I'm just waiting for Bart to try to talk to Luffy, to be honest. It's gonna be a disaster. 657, let's go. Go, Bart, go, buddy. <laughs> Who's he hiding from? Not to bump into what? Oh my gosh! Look for him with caution. It actually might take him a while to find him. The other straw hats must be here. <laughs> so <good. laughs> Sanji is no longer here. I hate to break it to you. Nami is no longer. Chopper is no longer here. Oh man, he's gonna miss out on so many straw hats. The great musician, So King. <laughs> How do you not like Bart, man? Is that where Luffy is? Down here? Oh, don't let anything happen to Bart, man. Nah, he's strong. He can defend himself. Oh. 
This is where they take the injured? Oh, shoot. There's a lot in here. Waiting for the medical treatment in the basement. <laughs> Straight up the doctor's office. Honestly, some are probably in here because of Bart. I'm not going to lie. He's going to agitate everyone. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. Treat the losers. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Stop, man. Stop. He's just going to make everybody fight. Oh, Bart. Oh, Bart. He said losers, huh? <laughs> No business here. He's like, my Luffy is not a loser. He would not be here. Mr. Sai! Wait, what? Don Chijiao? Is he okay? Something happening here? Oh, all of them are in here. There's an exit at the back of the room? Oh, wait, what? Why does this seem like a, like a plot point, though? Like, the fact that there's an exit, maybe? I guess I have to remember that the factory is underneath the Colosseum, like they said. Maybe that exit has something to do with it. I can't tell. Hmm. This I'm ge I'm getting kind of like nervous. It just makes me uncomfortable. What happens here? Wait, wait! What do they do? <gasps> is this where they turn people into puppets or toys? No way! They drop them down to the factory. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Left to rot! Wait! Oh my gosh! Even the giant! They're just left here to die? Chen Zhao! Yeah, what? Uh, can the giant not even break out? It's that big of a pit? Elizabello's here! Oh shit, we got one punch man! Even the fish man! But why would they be left there just to, like, die? This has to be a part of the factory. Oh, no. Oh, no. Don't me. Now there's a grudge against him. Interesting. Okay, now we know where the losers go. Holy. I was wondering why they were fixated so much on that, like, that underground area. This guy's so ego. Oh, he's going to get bodied. This is like that classic story of, uh, I, I, I'm gonna be honest, I don't even remember the names, but the guy that won with a slingshot where he's like tiny and he beat like the giant. How long is it gonna take Bart to find Luffy? Aww. She has a whole little fan club because she didn't give up on them. That night. <laughs> he does not care. Never mind. <laughs> I like how consistent that is. Nah, this is ex the exact opponent she wants, though. Like a big guy that's just gonna like overcorrect. Someone that's clumsy and won't be very like precise. Or maybe Cavendish comes in. Low key, I could see it. Guy's a unit. I just love giant characters like that, man, so much. Ugh. Oh, wait, she's going to use this guy. Just smacks him. Oh, he's distracted. Hang on. Rebecca could pull something. Oh, dude, I hate that sound. So oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, he's killing him. Are they booing because she's running? She's got a strat, man. Oh, dude, he's, like, hard targeting her. Oh, my gosh. She's trying to get him to chase her so that he makes a misplay and missteps. That's why they hate her, too. Not just because of who she is, but because of the way she fights. They want to see blood, like Doflamingo said. Oh, no. No blade? No blade! It'll take some real skills now, man. No! They said, I said, if they, if he, he got her, not like this. No, nah, I think Cavendish will try something now. Cause if they, like, he literally has like that grip strength. There's no remote chance she gets out. Unless this is like part of her plan. I don't know. I don't know how it could be because I, I don't believe like hundred percent. She has a devil fruit. That's why she's fighting for the flare flare fruit. But it seemed like most of her strategy was just being evasive. And now she's caught. Yep, there's the shot again. I need a counter of this shot right here. Oh my gosh, man. We gotta be at like 20 plus. 
Like, how is she supposed to break out? Pulverize! Pulverize! Oh my gosh. Monsters, all of you. I can't even imagine if he was watching this. He'd be freaking out. Wait, she's flashing back. Wait, this could mean she remembers something from her past that helps. <gasps> oh. And it was too late, though. Come on, Cavendish. Come on, buddy. Oh! Is that him? Oh, wait! Oh, shoot! Wait, shout out her! Oh my gosh, I forgot her name! Ag Agilia. Yo, shout out Agilia! She does keep smiling. She was the one that believed in Rebecca from the start, though. She got, like, a soft spot for her. Like, she was the one that told Cavendish, like, yeah, watch this. So they know each other. Yeah! She said, lock in, Rebecca! Oh, she's so nice, man. I love that sound effect. Like, it sounds like, like lightning. Oh, no. Oh, no. It was a big swing and a miss. Oh, my gosh! Get in there, Rebecca. This is your chance. Swipe him. Huh? She's going to launch off of her. Huge. Is she finally going to cut? Like, she's going to actually attack him? She's going to try. This is rare. He could just snatch her out of the air, though. Oh, no, she wanted him to think he would. She would. Now what? Oh, he's lost his balance. Someone kick him. Oh my gosh. She still hasn't caught him. Logan's done. Damn. Do they hate that she doesn't actually fight? <laughs> Yep, so it, yep, mm-hmm. It was honestly stupid of him to think that she would cut because like, she's not known for that. She's literally known for being evasive. I guess there's no, he, he literally had like coin flip based off that and he lost the coin flip. She's gonna try to get Rebecca to the finals. W, Rebecca. Luffy's so into it, man. <laughs> the shine. <gasps> this is what I've been saying the whole time, man. Go outside. Wait, he might run into Bart. <laughs> Bro, the soundtrack. <laughs> People who obey him, winners. People who disobey him, losers. <laughs> Just like the world government. So that scrap pit looks exactly like, yeah, where the, the lo oh, the losers literally of the Coliseum are tossed. It's the same place. Just different parts of the city. So they just left there to die? Just like, just like the toys that like become conscious and like realize that they used to be someone else. Mm. Oh my gosh, he thought of Great Terminal, damn. I guess it's kind of similar, yeah. Like people are discarded in society. He's still running in place. Okay, we find out like bit by bit, little by little more about Dressrosa. How things are seen too. Oh my gosh, he's gonna run into him. Oh no. He's gonna freak out, man. He'll literally explode. <gasps> there he is! Nah. Just keep calm, Bart. Don't explode! He might die. But like I said, we find out bit by bit, little by little more about Dressrosa. And sort of like, I, I guess all the, the, the way different people are seen or see everything, but there's still so many mysteries. I think the one, the biggest one to me still is the fact that toys and humans can't be in the same place at night. Like midnight, it's no matter what. Even whenever the soldier like disobeyed, uh, I guess, Doflamingo and they ran away and he raised Rebecca, even then he wouldn't be in the same place at night, despite the fact that he could protect her way better if they did stay in the same place. So what happens at night to toys, bro? Like, I, I, the most likely scenario at this point is literally they turn into werewolves. But dude, this pit must be insanely deep. The fact that even the giant can't get out and the fact that Elizabello's Isab uh, punch can't get them out. Like this was in the making for so long. But the question is, what are the inner workings of the factory then? If it is underneath the Colosseum, like they said, and what are the the Tontata Kingdom's like next move, especially against the Don, Don Quixote family. There's just a lot of moving parts and I'm super here for it. Guys, that's been it for my reaction today. I hope you did enjoy. Make sure you leave a like on this one. It does help me out quite a bit and I'll see you next time. Peace, peace.